welcome back. I'm Amy from White Cottage Home and Living. Thanks for joining me today. I'm going to be showing you how to put together your own DIY fire starters. These are super cute, smell great, and are perfect for getting your fire started. So this is a great DIY gift idea or something that you could use all winter long in your own fireplace. So thanks for joining me today. fire starters are made of wax and you can add into them a variety of different things to make them smell really good. Uh, in mine, I'm including cinnamon sticks, cloves, and also rosemary. That combined with the wax and a short wick to light it, you can put right into your fireplace and it'll help your fire get started. Not only that, but they smell great as well. So let's take a look at how I made these DIY wax fire starters. I started by using a muffin tin and putting my liners down in there. I also wanted to add several different types of herbs like I mentioned. So I started with rosemary and I cut little pieces of that and added that in to each little muffin liner. Next came the cinnamon sticks and then I put a few little cloves in each one. Besides the herbs that I used, you could also use lavender, which I think would smell wonderful as well. When you purchase your wicks, they're going to come very long, so I cut mine in half. You want it to come out just about an inch or so off the top of the lip of the muffin liner. When you go to melt your wax, I would highly recommend you use a pan that's going to be exclusive for these types of projects. You can purchase one like I did and I use it only for my candle making or wax projects. Because once you've used your pan, it's very, very difficult to get the wax off. So this one I just keep for any time I'm going to do this type of project. So you're going to be stirring the wax constantly until it's completely melted clear. So you're just gonna fill up your hot wax into each muffin liner, just leaving a little bit of room at the top. Finally, you're just gonna set these aside and let them set up. It'll be a couple of hours before the wax has hardened and they can be used. They look really beautiful once they're all ready you almost don't even want to use them for your fireplace because they just would make a great decor item as well. an example of another DIY fire starter that I made a couple of years ago. I took pine cones, added a wick, and then I dipped them in colored wax, added a little bow and tag, and they made the cutest little hostess gifts. This project you can find on the blog. Keep in mind that these fire starters are only for wood burning fireplaces. So when you get ready to use it, just stick it in there. It's like any other kindling. Once you light the wick, then it just takes a few moments for it to start. And the next thing you know, you have a beautiful roaring fire. 
Thank you so much for stopping by. I create new content that comes out weekly on home decor, cottage style, gardening, recipes, and thrift store finds. I'd love for you to join our community by subscribing. That way you'll be notified every time a new video is published. Have a great day.